official project this year. Decided to do something really crazy. We're calling it the Terra Trike. Well, since the last time we talked, a lot of parts came in. When, when you got all the parts you needed, uh, everything goes much quicker. Mikey's out there machining the back section for the swing arm. Mike came into the company, he was just a laborer. Uh, he started in buffing like everybody else does. And uh, moved from buffing to helping me to bending and back and forth. And now he does a little bit of everything. That's what takes all the time, all the little parts you gotta make everything by hand because there is nothing out there like this. We got the front end started, we got some of the heim joints, we used the spindle that I made for something else before and decided to upgrade the other thing, so now we're using the spindle. Here's some of the different uh, spherical rod ends we used. This one holds the spindle and this is the upper one to control the caster and camber. Still got to make one uh, the upper, upper and arm for this side. We got heim joints and spacers and, and brackets, we made a lot of brackets and uh, bushings just for the entire front end. And this is where our shock's going to attach to, going down here. Another day on the front end and we'll have the whole front end on. The next biggest thing is, after we get all this, designing what it's going to look like, the bodywork. Something that'll catch people's eye. I think I might be going for some type of military science fiction type theme. I've been looking on the internet, I found some stuff like out of the Xbox. Halo, some kind of crazy futuristic vehicle that they might be driving. It's something that the military could be possibly interested in at a later point. It's got crazy big wheels and stuff already. It's going to have a good wide stance, man. Definitely built for cornering and stuff. We should have a top speed of about 109 miles an hour. We did a lot today. I'm still going to add a skid plate to the bottom. And we have to order one more thing for the swing arm. We'll have all the parts we need to just about finish this whole project, so it'll go quick now. About how long do you anticipate until completion? Uh, approximately two and a half weeks.